Oh, we didn't talk about this on here. So Joel Santana um, turned himself in to authorities after last week. Uh, I don't know where he was trying to go, but he was at the Newark airport. And I guess it was going through TSA. And the agents found a gun in his carry-on luggage. Now, I said previously, oh. and I'll say again, if anybody knows what kind of weed Joel Santana smokes, my God, just give me some. Share. I don't have <laughs> any of any weapons to take with me uh, like that to an airport to get arrested. Right. Um, but I do love being high at the airport before a good flight. Cannot fly with that well i, I mean, mean i'm sure i could but why would i for what there's too many ways to get high it's just stupid. <laughs> so no i mean my god so they found this <laughs> gun on him um and he decided that the best option for him in that moment was to flee the scene very quickly and Smart apparently guy. hop into a cab and i guess go home or to a friend's house or i don't know what don't happened know what this nigga was going through the problem he was so high. Crystal, like, there's no... The problem with this is... um, People could see you. <laughs> Number one, you're invisible. You know, um, you're also Joel Santana. Uh, so people know who you are. Especially up north, where you currently are. It's not hard. I mean, it's, it's Newark, nigga. It's... Okay. So... It didn't take this too is a long. federal location. Like this is, I don't even think he was advised. I'm sure it just wore off. Whatever his high came down, he was like, "Oh, I guess I gotta go." <laughs> like you could not have possibly thought you were going to get away with this. You were at the airport. You can't just <laughs> TSA is not gonna be like, "Oh, never mind." What? What gun? Oh yeah, let's throw it away. <laughs> <laughs> had to a bit high because nobody who wasn't <laughs> would have run. <laughs> nobody. Uh, I just have to know what strain it is. There's no way that, like, oh man. Huh. So, uh, oh, besides the, the gun, uh, he's also been booked on possession of drug charges. No. Because they found Oxycontin, I guess, in his bag too. Oh my God. Um, possession of a firearm brought by a convicted felon. That he really help. did pick up the dope boys. Back. Well, the dope boy. Who knows? He really did. Like, I'm just thinking, how many guns do you have on your person that is just like when oh, you forget forgot. that you have one? Right. This is my gun bag. Like, <laughs> <laughs> what? And enough oxy for it to be like noticeable and clearly not a prescription. Oh, sir. Guns and drugs at an airport? That Jesus. nigga going to jail. Damn. Wow. Well, that's a sad story. That's real unfortunate, man. Like, because it was so preventable. He's got kids and, and a Kimbella and a whole bunch of stuff. Like, oh, you don't have time to be just going right, to jail right, right. over silly mistakes. Well, I mean... I don't even know what to say to you other than good luck because you're not getting out of that. I mean, there's just no way <laughs> right. that you can there's get no out arguing. of that. There's no arguing. It's really bad. <laughs> that was a very bad it's thing. Really, normally, I try to be optimistic, but this is just really bad. This is not good. 